guys welcome to my youtube channel my name is rona nelson like it and subscribe it so today we want to see how to calculate kcse uh, cluster points so in this case we have um, this formula by using this formula okay this formula is a uh, old-fashioned but uh, it is uh, up to date uh, th these days we have um, uh, different apps uh, like uh, softwares which you can just insert your you are creates or you are you are max and then or you are points subject then it's automatically uh, uh, display your cluster points but um, maybe you don't have that app so you can use the this uh, this formula so um like my video and subscribe follow me uh, if you subscribe you will get uh, my videos uh, weekly okay let's go on so in this case we have a c is equivalent to root of x all over 48 multiplied by y all over 84 a in bracket square root all then you multiply all through by 48 okay this 48 uh, it is from 12 multiplied by 4 subjects or uh, units this 84 is from uh, 7 multiplied by 12 you will get this 84 okay where now c where now you can see c is the same as um, cluster point so c is cluster cluster points so this z represent cluster points and then we have y uh, x this is x x represent uh, points obtained in the four main causes so this one is the points points obtained then in the four in the four main causes so if we say uh, causes this one is like uh, we are saying subjects so this one is uh, like uh, we are saying subjects four main subjects uh, which is required uh, any required subjects uh, in the course you want to pursue so then here we have y y is the total points of the seven courses chosen or subject so uh, total this one means total uh, points of the seven uh, of the seven courses courses or uh, uh, courses chosen or subjects so this one is the same as uh, subjects this one is the same as subject now okay if you say total points how can you get a point on a on a subject first you should know there exists uh, this system you have maybe 12 is equivalent to a if you score an a is there is equivalent to 12 uh, points okay another thing we should know uh, 11 is equivalent to a minus then we have 10 is equivalent to p plus okay another thing you have uh, 9 is equivalent to p then we have 8 is equivalent to p minus so, so this is 8 is equivalent to p minus then you have uh, you have uh, uh, seven is equivalent to c plus then you have six is equivalent to c you have five is equivalent to c minus this is minus then you have um four is equivalent to a uh, d plus then you have three is equivalent to d then you have uh, two is equivalent to d minus then you have uh, one is equivalent to e so this is the where, where you cut points from the subjects okay so i want to we want to work on example so here now example we want to work by uh, example let's say uh, you want to do or you want to pursue nothing you want to pursue nothing so the required uh, the required uh, subject for nursing of course we know uh, one 
last bus biology so we have biology you have biology so you should pass let's say you get c plus of which this c plus is equivalent to seven points okay we have another thing chemistry the chemistry okay in this chemistry uh, let's say you should pass c plus which is uh, again seven points seven points okay another another thing is uh, math so we have here maths so let's say as you should uh, bus to get uh, c plus so but in this case let's uh, let's assume we have scored uh, b minus so this b minus is the same as eight points if you see b minus is the same as eight points there okay um let's say we want one of the language languages let's say english so in this case english let's say you have a b plus so this b plus is the same as uh, 10 points 10 points so this um first for one two three four biology chemistry maths english give us um the x value so this one will give us the x value so if you had seven plus seven plus eight plus ten um this will give us a total of uh, 32 so x now will be uh, x now will be uh, 32 so will give us a total of 32 okay so we will come now and replace this 32 in our our formula where there is x we will put 32 okay so we want to see for y y uh, and we know y is total points of the seven courses chosen or subjects so in this case let's assume one um one of the of basu biology chemistry maths english so we want three to add other three here so that it become seven so seven now let's add uh, x y Kiswahili. Let's assume one has scored in Kiswahili uh, A, let's say A, which is the same as 12 points, 12 points. Okay, and then we have a business, let's say business studies, let's say one has scored uh, C, which is the same as 5, 5 points. Okay, and then uh, let's say one uh, did history, history, um, let's say one half scored uh, d minus let's say even d minus so this d and a minus is equivalent to two points so if you add these two uh, all these seven subjects now uh, seven plus seven plus eight plus ten um, plus twelve plus five plus these two okay this one goes to 50 51 so this is two points okay this one now will be uh, equivalent to y which is total which is equivalent to 51 this is the same as 51 because they are a uh, seven uh, seven subject okay we go now to the formula we calculate c is equivalent to square root of x but x is uh, 32 we are obtaining x to be 32 all over 48 uh, from the formula there up there then you multiply it by uh, y but we have obtained y to be uh, 51 this is our y but uh, this is our x so our y is 50 51 then we divide it by the 4 and you know where we obtain it for then we, we do the square root square root of that one then we multiply by uh, 48 um if you do this one using a, a calculator then we use uh, my calculator here so i have uh, 32 32 uh, divided by 48 48 um, multiplied by 51 divided by uh, 84 4 okay so here i will get um 0.0 c now will be 
so c now will be my c now will be 0 0.6362 zero nine zero one and then now i multiply by 48 so this one will give my cluster points will be now 30.5380 which is now approximately uh, cluster point wins points now will be approximately 30 point let's write to four uh, decimal places so 30.5380 so this one will be uh, my cluster points which is a z which is approximately 30.5380 um, this is a quite easily done this is my cluster so that's now how to use this formula to obtain your cluster um, there is a table sometimes uh, you can use a table but uh, because most people don't have those tables you can now uh, use uh, this formula to calculate your cluster points so that you reduce your course you want to go and pursue uh, for further studies uh, learning so goodbye